How can you make your white paints cover and hide even better? This week, I teamed up with Nick O'Keefe of Oak City Coatings in Raleigh, North Carolina. Nick is a paint expert, and he has a great contractor trick for making white paints perform better, especially on repaint jobs where coverage and hide are very important. Today, we're sharing that secret with you on The Honest Carpenter Show. So there are a lot of white paint products on the market, some of which you can use straight out of the can. For instance, Nick was a rep for Sherwin-Williams for a number of years, and he still trusts their duration line for exterior repainting, as well as their super paint line for other applications. Both of these products come in whites that can be used without tinting. So when you buy a new can, they can go straight from the can onto the wall. They're ready for use. Keep in mind, you can't do this with every paint product you see on a shelf, even if it's technically white paint, because some products have to be mixed with tint or pigment before they're ready for use. If you're wondering how to tell the difference, just look for small print on the can label. Most paints will always have a note near the bottom that says whether it should or can be mixed. Base paints, for instance, always have to be mixed with something. They're not ready for wall coating out of the can because they're not formulated for it. Products like Interior Super Paint Extra White, however, are variable. They can have tint added or they can be used as is, straight from the can, and they'll serve as a good white paint color. You just wanna confirm what you're getting before you buy it by reading the label because there are variations even in super paint. But Nick's exterior white paint of preference is actually this duration super white. Notice that it doesn't have any visible guide on tinting. This is because it's ready to be used out of the can. And on top of that, it's actually a high coverage white that hides exterior trims even better. How does it do this? Basically, it's specially formulated to hide better. More than likely, it already contains a combination of tint or pigment and a handful of other high quality chemicals. Duration Super White is a top grade product. Many, many pros use it and even blog about it. And the main reason they use it is because it hides so well, it often only requires two coats on a job, cutting out a pricey and laborious third coat. It also repels moisture and pollutants better, adheres better over time, and lasts longer. The problem is, it's also very expensive. At current inflated rates, it's going for like 80 plus a gallon, which is gonna be out of some people's budget. So how can you get simpler, cheaper white paint products to cover and hide as well as Duration Super White? Nick has a fairly reliable trick, and it comes down to diluting it slightly with a certain combination of tint. Tint is a pigment mixture added to paint to give it color and to increase its opacity. It's introduced to unmixed paint in very particular quantities to create a desired color and consistency in the final product. Pretty much every paint you buy will already have some tint in it. But if you want your basic white paints to cover and hide a little better, you can often add just a little bit more. Nick says you want to introduce a particular volume and color combo to a one gallon mixture. That is two ounces of white tint plus one thirty second of an ounce of black tint. This isn't very much. The white pigment amount is about a shot glass full and the black pigment is basically a couple drops from an eyedropper. This really won't change the color of your white paint. The volume of black pigment is just too small but it'll give the paint a bit more opacity and tone, and this will help it cover and hide a surface better. Two coats of a modified white paint like this will better conceal base layers of paint beneath it, even on color change projects. It'll essentially function like a more expensive super white product. And keep in mind, you can do this with really any kind of white paint. That includes exterior semi-glosses or flat white ceiling paints and everything in between. The trick is finding stores that'll mix it for you. Nick points out that designated paint stores like Benjamin Moore or Sherwin-Williams or mom and pop paint stores are more likely to have the willingness and equipment to add these small tint mixtures for you. Whereas the big box stores like Lowe's and Home Depot really aren't set up for this kind of custom mixing. In some cases, their machines or programs simply won't let them. So you're better off seeking out specialty suppliers and working with their less expensive product lines. So that's how you improve coverage and hide on basic white paints. Nick and I are going to do a much longer, more technical video on how paint mixing works, which is a surprisingly fascinating topic. But for now, we'll wrap this video up. Let us know what you thought of it down in the comments. I'll also include Oak City Coatings contacts in the description below. They're a great paint company serving the NC Triangle area, including Raleigh, Cary, and Garner. As always, thanks for watching. Be sure to check back in for more videos coming up soon. And please consider subscribing and hitting that bell button to turn on notifications. That way you'll know the moment we post something. I'm Ethan James with The Honest Carpenter. I'll see you next time.